going on guys I'm up here with uh, the testo smart probes doing a uh, cooling performance on the system just with the 2605 eyes and calculating your CFMs and you can see 1605 I is in the supply not in the way of uh, any potential radiant cooling just like you can have radiant heating um, same thing with the uh, with the return sensor the other 605 I it's in the return but it's away from the uh, the return box down there just to try and minimize my false readings as much as possible and it's been running now for about about close to 20 minutes now so you can see everything's kind of steadied out this is a three and a half ton system and as you can see it appears that we are performing pretty darn well but also I have my probes connected outside which is crazy because a lot of people they uh, they're discouraged about the Testo Smart Probes because there's a lot of people online saying they only have a 10 foot, uh, 10 foot radius as far as their, their reception of the Bluetooth. So we'll just see. We'll click here and we'll go down to AC plus refrigeration. What? Get out of town. Nope, it's not magic. Not magic at all. Um, roughly about 25 to 30 feet away from the condenser. And uh, obviously, through a few walls, so our condenser is line that goes all the way back there, and then down one floor to the uh, condenser outside. But I'm having no issues at all picking up our sensors. We're calling for 10 degrees of subcooling as well, which we are right on the nose. So this system is running very well, very well. So we'll go back to our. BTU cooling power right there but can't say enough about these probes cost wise performance accuracy um, everything it's it's the total package um, like I said there's there's many comparable sets out there that you can get um, I don't want to talk bad about any of them all of them are great and have their place in our trade but for me and what I do it's a no-brainer. The Testo Smart Probes, I, I, I'd go back to them every single time. So, there you go. I don't want to make this too long because i got to finish this maintenance and get on to the next one. But, just uh, figured I'd do that and we'll go back one more time and see. Just to make sure, because you never know. We might lose signal. Um, negative. Negative, Ghost Rider. Uh, we still got plenty of signal. So, there you go. Hope that helps anybody that was considering the Testo Smart Probes, and thanks for watching.